Alrighty, this is Charlotte. It's free game on Steam. And this would be my third recording of it. I've gotten all of two minutes into the game so far. And first time the game would not load at all. It got stuck on a loading screen right at the beginning. Second time I got the game. And, well, looking, seeing this opening menu, which is very, very Spartan. But this also happens to be the menu you open using the tab key in the game. The exact menu. You have new game, load game, quit game. Save game is not an actual choosable option. Menu is not a choosable option. And there's literally no button on the keyboard which allows me to leave the menu. So if you happen to open the menu while playing the game, well, I hope you saved it. Or you don't mind playing it over again, because... Yeah, there's no way out of the menu. Hitting tab again does nothing. It's a bit frustrating. Especially considering the first time the game didn't load in the first place. I got to the screen... Well, technically the screen the picture changes, but... Please stand by at the top, and then it just sat there doing nothing. But yeah, I mean, tab does open the menu. I'm I'm don't know if X saves the game or not. I'm assuming it does. I pushed X. I don't know if it saved it. I'm I would hope, but yeah, there's nothing else you can really do with the menu, which sucks. So this is like some 19th century walking simulator. And there's a bunch of stuff to read, which I'm um, supposed to be in, like a horror game too. So far, the only horror has been getting stuck in the menu and not being able to do anything about it. But it's it's free on Steam, as well it should be after the problems I've gone through so far. But apparently, it's also available with an adult version on Ichio, which uh, yeah, no thank you. I can barely get this one to work. So, oh look, there's someone named Charlotte. Oh dear god. Um. Everything fitted now. Everything fitted now. Other impulse fished in the convenient pocket for change? Oh, oh, please tell me this is going to be bad English. There's a lot of not so... It seems like it's trying to be... Um... Yeah, it's trying to throw out all these big words, which made me think the English would at least be somewhat decent. But that, that was two examples there that... Or not. I'm... You know what? Wow. Um... Yeah, if you want to read all of this... I suggest you go ahead and download the game. Because... Yeah, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna go through all this. That's a lot. Um, also... Okay, I thought I was stuck in that as well. There was no exit. Sorry, my mouth is... mouth. My mouse is scrolling up again. Oh, okay. I'm gonna read a couple of these just because now I think there might be some bad English, which would be great. Advanced class necessarily well. Healing instruction on the ground. No, some of it's probably supposed to be, like, period. Writing. So it's supposed to sound a little weird, but still. Oh boy. There's a lot of reading in this game, obviously. Um. Excuse me? Why did that just pop up? <laughs> like, I'm trying to read stuff, I, I, and you're talking about locks. Uh, 
Oh boy, more books. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, um... I'm, I'm not even looking at this, sorry. It's like, seriously, they're whole books? I, I, no. I'm not, I'm not going through all that right now. This is not supposed to be that kind of a game, I thought. Let me out. No, I'm gonna go out of limb and say there's gonna be jump scares, so let me turn my volume down a little bit so I don't go deaf. Yeah, there's, there's a lot of them wanting you to read stuff. Why am I talking to a pot? Um... Seriously, I'm talking to a pot. Um... Um, no. Oh. Hey, first of all, you're a ghost. Second of all, why can I talk to you when I'm, like, looking in any direction? <laughs> they, that hot spot was... Yeah, this hot spot is not set up quite, quite well enough. You shouldn't be able to, like, look over here and talk to someone who is clearly on the opposite side of you. Oh god, I can look at the paintings too. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure the writing is all... See, again, that needs to not be a thing. You have to set up the hot spot. You can't just have it be... You're staying in a specific spot. That's... That's problematic. But yeah, I'm not gonna look at every damn picture on the walls, I'm sorry. I mean, I'm sure there's some interest there for some people, but... There, this is, especially with the books, this is very reliant on you reading things to make it longer. And that's kind of excessive, in my opinion, when you put that much reading in. Because it's like, do you, is that all? I hope that's not the whole story behind the game, because that would be very obnoxious. Because it's already not got anything, but... Does not do anything? Okay. Um, right. It's already got no actual dialogue. Like, their speech, I should say. So... Um... Which, I mean, yeah, it's an indie game, so you don't really necessarily expect there to be speech. But when you put that much reading in it as well, it becomes kind of annoying. So, I mean, like, look, look at this room. One, two, three, four... Looks like six, possibly? Maybe seven? No. Looks like six notes just looking here right now. It's... So much to do. And again, doesn't matter where you are, as long as you're standing right there, you interact with them. And that's... That, that, that kind of takes away from stuff. Because it's like, why can I... I'm just gonna look up at the ceiling and have a conversation. I mean, really? It is tired of reform time, but realize how we have indirectly, blah blah blah. And just help equality of sex, establish the federal relations. I'm not sure if this is supposed to be like a women's rights thing. 
Because that's what it seems to be skewing towards. But it's also clearly a period piece as well. So... I don't know. It's kind of weird to put those two pieces together like that. I think I looked at that already. But yeah, there's a ton of things to look at. What the hell is even going on here? Seriously, I... Whatever. Enhance that house. Oh boy, Wordleberry Pie. Oh, and I could read that. I saw that before, but I didn't think. Oh my god. There's four more things I didn't see when I walked in the room. It's like, you know, I'm, I'm not looking at things unless they're like pictures at this point. Because. You're putting way, way too much of this stuff in there. And not relying on actual real interactions with things. You're just relying on people reading... Reading everything. I, I mean, I'm sure people playing this are like, Oh yeah, this is interesting. I'm going to read all this, but I... I was expecting this to be something a little less than collecting 80 billion notes to figure out what's going on. I mean, there, there's... If they weren't every two, two steps, it wouldn't be so bad. But there's a note, like, everywhere. You can't go anywhere without finding notes. There's three on this one table. And then that just floating there, and now it's not. Um, assuming that was a bug? Like, I don't think it was supposed to be visible. I think, what? Now it's gone. Maybe it was supposed to be visible? I, I don't know. Does it fit fast? Really, I think if you're the one writing a bunch of this crap, then that, that's, I totally agree. You shouldn't be... You should not be looking around for your pen and paper to write more notes. You have enough notes. They're, I mean, they're even on the floor. Like, there's so many of them. They're all over the floor. Again, these doors are so weird. It's like, what, what, why did they have buttons for all the doors? Damn it. But yeah, that hotspot thing needs to be fixed so it's like not. not popping up every time you face them. Or every time you're near them, as instead it should be when you face them, it should open up. Or not open up, but uh, let you interact. Because that's a little bit. A little bit annoying. A little bit awkward when, like, when I tried to click on that pot in the other room and started talking to the woman because I didn't see her. So. Something else I'm supposed to be doing? Okay, door opened. This door? That whispering really isn't creepy. It's just a little whispery. <sighs> occasionally. No, I thought it said he strikes me occasionally, which would have put this in a different perspective at least, I guess. Trying to ignore those. Oh god. How can I get those out? There. You are making such. Um, it said something else, but it 
just disappeared. Yeah, I'm not sure what exactly I'm supposed to be doing. I guess I'm supposed to be trying to open doors by clicking on these things. Oh, that's inconvenient. Or does that mean white opens doors and red closes doors? So you just want to hit all the white buttons to open these doors? I mean, that's my assumption, is we're trying to open doors to go other places, so... The problem is the sounds don't seem quite placed right. Like, I'm hearing sound, I'm hearing the door open, but I'm not exactly hearing it open from the correct place. I don't know, that just might be my headset not doing its job. Um. So, hit all the white buttons that I found anyway. Um. Uh. Nope. There's a red one over here for some reason. That doesn't do anything. Um. Trouble is, I'm not entirely certain what it is I'm supposed to be doing. Am I supposed to escape or something? Like, everyone you talk to doesn't really give you any indication, necessarily. They just give you sort of vague story bits. Am I supposed to close some of the doors? Because I'm not entirely sure what's going on. And it's really pushing this whole women's rights thing, for some reason. Uh, it just feels forced, I guess. Like, why am I... Why is that what this is about? Okay, that opened that door, which is not what I wanted to do. Is that a door? It's a door, I think, but... Oh, well, God, talking to someone. And, like, a lot of these just don't seem to do anything for whatever reason. one close that door for whatever whatever purpose I wonder if we're supposed to read everything to find out what we're supposed to do but there's so many damn things to read that it's like I don't feel like that's worthwhile I mean the books alone are just ridiculously long I'm gonna try and shut all the doors, maybe? Because opening them didn't seem to do anything. I'm wondering if there's supposed to be like a combination of doors. It's supposed to open something. But even then, that's really, really hard to figure out. Some of these buttons don't seem to do anything. Okay, that's not what I wanted to do. I was hoping that would open the other door. Which... 
Doesn't seem to be a thing. Uh, this is mildly confusing. Mostly because I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing, so I'm just... Oh, what, now that button worked? What did it... What? Why did that button suddenly work? And what did it do? A door opened, but what door? I heard the door open. No. Now none of these seem to be working. Oh, what, now that one? I think the places you're supposed to click on are not quite lined up. Because I feel like... Damn it. I feel like actually centering on it is not working. Because I, I centered on the one, it did nothing, then all of a sudden it did something. Oh, what, this is open now. Hey. That's messed up. Oh, look, a book. And now it's... Uh. <laughs> okay. And it didn't let me leave that screen for whatever reason. Door open, but I feel like... Oh, I can't click on the text? That's kind of weird. If you click on the text, it doesn't close. At least... No, now it does? Okay. I, I'm confused. Okay, that door opened, and I don't know why I care. Or what was knocking that I was supposed to care about. Oh. Oh, that one's gone. So... Now what? They're still here. But that first person seemed to disappear. Almost interesting? But then again, kind of not. That woman's still here. Do I have to talk to him again? Because I don't... I feel like I've not accomplished anything. I feel like going in that room started to accomplish something, and then it just didn't. Like... I don't know. Oh, wait, no, she's not gone. She's right here. Uh, it's in the study, wherever that is. Oh, okay, the door opened that I don't know where. And the clock went off. Well, that one opens the other door, so I don't want to worry about it. So now I'm just kind of pressing around everything, because you can't really tell where the actual button is. So, I mean, this was supposed to be the study. But obviously, he's not in here. And it's not bugging, or not bugging up, but it's not locking me in here anymore. Wait, what? That opened the door and... Oh, boy. Still not this door, but... It opened the door. question is, what door? This door. Oh, no, is it going to close behind me? Hello? No? 
Weird breathing, that's surprising. Something bad's going to happen, isn't it? Oh, look, it's that John guy we were talking about. I play the piano. So I guess this is the study. Alright, let's talk to this John guy for whatever reason. I don't weigh a bit more near as much. Nor as much, excuse me. I feel really much easier about you. It's also the fact that all of you are ghosts. That's a little confusing to me. The door shut. What, now I can't interact with you? Oh, oh yeah, I can. Well, I can't leave this room. You locked me in, sir. Maybe if I look at this here painting. Button? I don't see a button. Oh, look, the door opens. Oh. That's a thing. Are you sure of what? Uh, yeah. Please stand by. <laughs> is this a... <laughs> it's such a weird loading screen phrase to have. So, what now? I guess this game doesn't really have jump scares. Yet. I say that, and of course that's what's gonna happen. Unless that knocking noise from earlier was supposed to be a jump scare. Which I doubt. Okay. What now? Also, that's not really wallpaper. It's door. What am I supposed to be doing here? Can't seem to do anything. It's very, very dark. Do I go to bed? Yeah, that is kind of dumb. Oh, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing here. Uh, uh whatever. Force. Still a window. Um. I can't go anywhere, so... What am I supposed to be doing? Petition for divorce, that doesn't really help me. Do anything about the bed being down to the floor? Door won't open.
No, oh, here we go. Ah, oh, sweet, there's a ghost lady. Oh. Well. Oh, there's. Oh. Well, now I'm just annoyed. Where's the ghost lady? I want to talk to her. Also, if this, if this feels like it was a timing based thing since I couldn't do anything for so long and I still can't friggin' do anything. Um. So. Um. What? Hold on, let me just clip through this here wall. Wow. That... <laughs> yeah. That's, that's a mistake. Someone screwed up that window when they made this. I wonder if this window does it. Oh, that window works. But I like this window. I can just go outside through the damn wall. Oh my god. That's great. That that is that is great. Just... Oh God! Someone help me! I'm outside. Let me in. Seriously though, I can't seem to do anything here. And if this is a damn timing-based thing, wait, what? Um. Okay, where did that come from? Cause well, it looks like I'm screwed right now. Because my mouse cursor didn't change to an actual cursor that's still in the middle of the screen like I'm in first person mode. And I can't use the keyboard to choose options. So yeah, um, I guess this is it for this game. So if you couldn't tell, not really a huge fan. Way, way too much notes and books and crap laying around. Like, I, if you really want a game where you have to read a lot, I guess, great. That's great, but then you start to have these bugs. Like, I can't do anything now, because I triggered the door at the same time I triggered this woman, apparently. Which caused the mouse to revert to first person even though I'm in a conversation. Then you had that window that you can walk straight through. It's free and all, but it really needs work still. Like, not being able to do anything with the menu. See, right here. Cannot exit the menu. Have to load a game or go to a new game. And I click load game and it doesn't appear to be doing anything. Oh, there, it loaded the game. But yeah, it puts me here. That's another thing. Like, like it, I think this is a thing where it's actually not putting you all the way back at the beginning. But it kind of is, because the doors are all reset. So you might as well have not gotten anywhere. Because there's really, like, no... I don't think there's anything that actually is progression, per se. I mean, maybe you can open doors and get in there easier now. But... Yeah, that, that kind of makes it not worth it either. But yeah, the menu being messed up is a major, major issue. Especially when loading the game doesn't really load the game where you are. And then the bugs... The, it could be a good game. It needs less of these notes. I mean, let's see. One, two, three, four right here. The paintings also count, so there's five, six, seven, eight, nine. Just from this spot, I can click on nine things and have a bunch of stuff to read. 
Like, that's... It's a little excessive. I mean... And it's not even short. And then you got the books, which are actual books. It's just... It's way more reading than really you need. I'm still not sure what the point of the game even is. But... Oh well. <laughs>